Taurus sun, Taurus Virgo, Capricorn. We're going to find out, um, you know, what your person feeling, okay, what's coming in for love. You have the Seven of Swords. You guys might be dealing with people who you can't trust. This could be family. This could be friends. This could be your person. Um, you have the Page of Pentacles. So you might be dealing with somebody who was maybe running from commitment in the past or doing things like deceitful. But I feel like this person is ready to do things differently here with the Page of Pentacles. This is trying new things to get different results here, okay? The Ten of Cups because it's worth it, okay? Because this is something that they feel like it's going to last. So if your person before was like untrustworthy or somebody who goes to do walked away from you, I do feel like maybe they want to um, they want to try to do things a little bit different, okay, this time. You have the Nine of Pentacles. I feel like they've been doing a lot of work. They've been healing themselves. They've been like, you know, a lot of self-love. Doing a lot of good work for themselves. The Sun card as well. This is like Leo energy. You could be dealing with a Leo. Or you guys could just be dealing with somebody who is like really focused on themselves. Focused on their like happiness. On their goals. Very goal oriented. Okay, you might be into somebody who's like really into their work. This person might be somebody who has their own business, the Three of Pentacles. They could be somebody who works for the community, or maybe you do. But I feel like this person really is coming back. Um, or if they're already with you, I feel like this wants, this person wants to try to um, do things differently and try to rebuild with you because they see that, you know, this is something that would, would be worth it, okay? You have the High Priestess, the Tower. This is about, like, a sudden realization, okay? Um intuitively this person knows that they need to move forward and they need to come fast okay or this might be somebody that's kind of like at a distance from you all right um but they're ready to come in and i feel like with the tower card and the high priestess this might be something that you don't even see coming they're, this person might be keeping it secret so they might be secretly coming and visiting you or secretly messaging you um, and I feel like they're going to shock you because the way that they're coming in, like the death card, they've learned a lot. And they're not going to be the same person that they were when they first came in. They're going to be a changed person. I just did this reading. I forget what signs it was for, but somebody's coming in completely changed. So, <clears throat> could be Scorpio, Cancer, Taurus, Leo that you guys are dealing with. So, with Pentacles, there's going to be a choice here, okay, because, um... For some of you, for some of you guys, it's gonna be hard for you guys to make a choice because you're gonna be unsure with this person. You're unsure what you're gonna get with this person. With the wheel of fortune, it's like you spin the wheel, you never know where it's gonna land. So maybe this person's unpredictable, and maybe you feel like they're going to be unpredictable. With the death card though, and the chariot and the tower, and first of all, all four, five um, major arcanas in a row. This is about like change, you know, change, change, moving forward on a spiritual journey, like seeing things for how they really are, you know, listening to your intuition, doing better things for yourself, okay? So your person's going through a massive change, a massive awakening at the moment. And so I feel like your person, when they come back, it's like you might not even want to give this person another chance, but I feel like you need to listen to what this person has to say because they may shock you with the growth um, and with how far that they've came, okay? So... That's what I got for you guys. If you guys like my content, please like and subscribe. Could be Aquarius too as well. This person, like I said, they're healed, all right? This person's got a lot of things aligning in their life. They're doing a lot better for themselves. So if you really want this person or you have this person blocked, maybe unblock them or um, give this person a chance to explain themselves. You got that again. I was just shuffling. So anyway, have a good night and take care. Toodles.